welcome back. We just finished over there cleaning out the rat unit that, if you're watching this video now, it's the previous video. It can be two, same day, one load. We just did the rat unit. But now we're about to do this other one here. This one right here, it was a live auction. Um, it's a 10 by 10. We actually ended up paying $625 for this one. There were some other people here and I was needing stuff, they were needing stuff, so we bid kind of went bumped heads but I ended up getting it but there's a lot of there's a lot of shoes in this one a lot of shoes looks like some other good stuff hopefully there's a nice looking bedroom set I can see all the pieces two big TVs we get the Minnie Mouse train here but hopefully we're gonna find some good stuff under there cleansing spa But lots of shoes. Um, these are LeBron James. LeBron James shoes. We've got a fan. But um, hopefully the bedroom set will be in um, pretty decent shape. And that will pay for a good chunk of the unit. And then all this little stuff down here will be where our profit is. But definitely more than I wanted to pay for it. For a 10 by 10 that's not even packed full. But, you know, I saw some good stuff. So, we're about to get busy here. We're going to see what we find. I don't see any rat droppings. I don't smell the rat pee. Hopefully, we're good as far as that goes for Anne's sake. She's she's still scared, though. She's looking in every little corner. Uh, I don't know. It might be a pug. Is that a TV? All right. Well, let's get busy. Yeah, there's two TVs there and there. And here, we got a... We got a bottle of Riscato Sweet Red Wine. Here we go. We got a little rack here. You're fine. Just because there's rack droppings does not mean they're one. You know, we've seen them in the majority of the units you get. Yes. All right. But we got lots of Nikes here. That's a nice Nike. Uh, let's see. Uh, it looks like mostly some paperwork here. But what do we have in the wallet? A million dollars. Um, not a million, no, only a hundred thousand, no, no money in the wallet. I guess let's try, like all the shoes, let's set all the shoes kind of over there so we can kind of keep them together. It might be easier to keep up when we go to, to get them out or shoe boxes. There's, um, <laughs> no shoes. We got some ketchup packets in this one. Ketchup packets. We get the Reebok Cardi B box, but there's some Nike, black Nikes in that one. What do we have here? It's like just some clothes. It sounds like there's something else in here. What is it? Okay, we got some cologne maybe. I don't know what that is. It's a Blue number one. Cavalier. CEO VIP for men. Okay. Brand new blanket. Hungry. We like brand new. Hungry turtles. I guess it's like hungry hippos. I haven't seen that before. Yeah, Billy just got this. It's a brand new blanket. Cozy. No, it's a robe. Cozy velvet robe. All right, we're gonna. Oops, sorry, that just came up. We're gonna get our shoes over here. See if we can piece hold them together. Is there shoes in there? We got a Reebok box. Ooh, some brand new, nice white Reeboks. Let's open that one. Let's see. Whoa, Nike box. We got some Nikes in it. Size 11 and a half, Cortez basic leather. So nothing in those. So the empty ones, let's put like right there. And we'll see. Yeah, we could put some of these in there probably. What kind of watch is that? Nothing special probably? No, it's oh. imitation leather. Imitation leather. Okay. There's another empty box. Oh. 
There's a Christmas present right here. It's for you. I'm scared. Wait, two um two royal. <laughs> it's royal. Like a doll. I think it's a big doll, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's two dolls. Merry Christmas, Billy. It's a two of us wispy walker doll. It's on the front there. There's a price tag stuck on it. $29.90. Who gives somebody a, a, a gift with a price tag stuck right on the front? <laughs> somebody, who, somebody in the family trying to keep up with who's doing what. Mm -hmm. All right. This is pretty nice. It's a, um, besides that nasty cup that's thrown in there. Farberware pressure cooker. All right. More shoes. Was this shoes? These are like women's. Boots, okay. And then we got more Billy, you just open your present and just throw it on the ground. Hey, Alright, four in one wireless speaker desk lamp. We already saw that. Um, here's some more here's some black Nikes Air Max. Here's a Jordan. It's in pretty good shape, if we can find the other one. All right, some kind of, some clothes and miscellaneous. Scooter. All right, here's some more shoes here. Got the kind of funky green. Got some brand new socks. We got baby shoes. Oh, the, oh, polo baby shoes. Oh. Okay, we got a. Um, we've got a bong in here. A bong to smoke with in a plastic container. So is this all socks in here? Okay. The, okay. Well, there's a lot of a lot of new ones in here. New, 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 new. So a bunch of brand new socks here. Okay, clothing there. Okay, so yeah, this is why you don't put food in your storage unit because then you get rats in there. Oh, we got the Paris picture. The pink Paris picture. Okay, we got. Lord of mercy. This junk's just falling out. Uh oh, here's a flash drive. No, it's not a flash drive. Or is it? It says alpha. No, it's a little flashlight. <laughs> I thought it was a flash. Okay, this is trash. Okay. All right, we got Polo Ruffle. Look, they wrote their name in there with a marker. They got a Polo shirt with a. This is Polo right here, Polo Ralph Lauren. All right, moving along. What's in there? Just some clothes or something? Yeah. Alright, we got a few boxes here. And we got shoes. Oh, we got tape. I'm always excited about tape because we can use that. And we got the boots here. Boots. Boots. Oh, and Billy's handing me a Reebok box. And, and we have some brand new, almost brand new ways, Pumas. Here in this box. I'm only handing you the ones that don't have shoes. Okay, this is hot tomato, whatever hot tomato is. In the hot tomato box, I guess we have some hot tomato boots, maybe. They're boots. Yeah, because there's a picture of them there. And we got the Nike box here. Nike Air Max, and these aren't Air Max. But 
they're just swapped from another box but nice pair of nikes there back to this box it's got women's shoes all the way down into it and even some fuzzy slides here so what those are women's shoes i guess i looked in that one yep And then we get the New Balance box. And we do have some New Balance, some funky New Balance. Look at these things, man. Look at the backs of them things. And then a Converse. There's Converse in there. Converse box. Look at these things. Converse, these kind of look clown looking, but somebody will like them. And the Converse All-Stars. And then another one of these fashion nova this is like women's shoes and they're in there some funky hills we got another nike box here with some reeboks in them like billy said most of the shoes are either like new or or like new you just you know you can tell they wore them just a few times just seen a quick wipe off A Louis Vuitton bag, or at least a, you know, fake one, but some Altoids. All right, important papers. We got important papers kind of just thrown in here. Um, that's a, tra a citation right there, traffic citation. Uh, yep, that one matches one that's over there. There's another wallet. Just some Kroger Plus card and that kind of thing. Yep, paperwork, paperwork. Just like it said, it is mostly paperwork. There's some feet right here to a TV. Probably one of those TVs there, so we might need those. Got the Dell computer. I think it needs batteries to get work. The toilet. All right, see if you can help her put some of that on. All right, down here, and this this is kind of falling out everywhere, and it's got a couple of these. We got a facial massager. We got a cleanser massager. We got flawless brows. Dermaplane. We got some hair, and then we got a little toss and catch game in here. Coffee maker. Was there anything in this iPhone box, Billy? No. A charger? That's I don't, maybe, I don't know. Wonder if there's gonna be some good shoes in here. Look, show and tell. Oh, there is shoes oh. in there. Show and tell oh, shoes. Yeah. All right, we get the Florida Gator car flag in this one. All right. Um, well, there's a, some new little stuff, some little palm olive, it's like a hairbrush. Clothing, clothing. All right, what do we have here? This one says Ebony's bathroom. I don't need my knife. I wonder if Ebony was a little girl or an adult. I don't know. Got several more boxes back here. I 
sitting in here we've got you know typical bathroom type stuff hair band you always got to look in the bathroom stuff for jewelry a lot of times you will find jewelry down in there but yeah we got blow dryer there's a straightener some different hair stuff down in there lots of hair bands okay We got another blow dryer. We got the Minnie Mouse train. This is nice right here. Includes 27 pieces of track. So you can actually make like a figure eight here. It's got some kind of powder spilled on it. So I'll have to wipe it off. It's like flour or sugar that like kind of, it's all over a bunch of stuff over here. Here's another doll. It's got the powder on it too. I don't know what that is, but Cocaine. I don't think so. Another doll. Got several new toys in here. They must have put some of their Christmas gifts in there. They never got them. Mm -hmm. We got a speaker. Sylvania Bluetooth little um, speaker. More blankets, blankets, blankets. More blankets. We got a camo sheet set, which is kind of unusual based off of the other stuff that they would have a camo sheet set. And it looks like we're gonna have some it's like a bunch of new clothes in here. New dresses. And hair. More hair. Been lots of hair lately. Beads, hair. Pair of Nikes. Set these over here. And what else? More hair. We got a stinking toilet to potty training toilet. That's gross. And here is a tiny Jordan box. And we got some little pink Jordans in here. And that's broke. Make sure there's nothing in here. Just some regular old sunglasses. But there's a couple more Nike boxes. That one's empty. And that one, yep, it's empty. And underneath there, oh, I think I, there's some more shoes. I think I see the other Jordan underneath there. All right, let's get this all closed. Well, oh, a shoe. There's the other Jordan, though. Let's set that over there. All right, and this one is full of Towels, 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 towels. And then a Nike hoodie thrown right on the top. This right here. Oh, here's a brand new little Maui Wowie kitchen set. All right, now look at what we got here. We got the Minnie Mouse. There's the charger. Minnie Mouse motorcycle with the sidecar. I guess you put like your stuffed animal 
inside that thing. And Billy's gonna take it for just ride that thing right into the trailer. Okay. Got gnats. I don't know if that's what's in here or not. Something's in here, but it doesn't sound like that. Uh, yeah, it is. Got a little burner. 11 piece frame set. And I don't know what that plug right there goes to. Maybe one of the monitors. Seasonings and rice. Let's just make sure that's what it is. And yep, it's all, that's all food, seasonings. Almost there, here's another computer monitor. And we got some routers and stuff in here. It's right. kind of cool right here. There definitely was a, a, a rat in this one too. There's drop, a lot of droppings back here. All right, kitchen. It's just regular old kitchen stuff, but we got pots, pans, plasticware. Gross. Pantry, maybe? I don't think it's spelled right. P-A-N-T-R-E-E. -E. Yep, and they just... No, no wonder they had rats. They just put the... Don't tell me they had bread in here. Oh my gosh. Why would you put bread in the storage unit? They got bagels, bread, all kinds of food, all kinds of food in here that makes no sense. But they thought they were going to get this stuff out of here. People think they're going to put it in here and get it out in the next week. But even so, bread isn't going to last. Why would you put bread in here at all? We do have the two TVs. It looks like there's two sound bars also. Probably had a sound bar with each TV. Vizio sound bar. A couple of nice pieces of decor here. There's a croc and another new toy, a Barbie Extra. I don't know what Barbie Extra is, but and we got Toy Story Memory. Unicorn Bouncer. I guess this thing comes out of this egg right here. <laughs> Unicorn Bouncer. That looks like something you might want for one of your kids. All right, just we'll just start loading everything now. Coke jacket. They might have worked for Coke because this is like the work uniform type Coke jacket. Paper. Clothes. We got New Year's Eve stuff. Oh, we got a head. It clamps on, clamp on head. All right, we're finishing up this unit. The um, bedroom set here, it's in pretty decent shape. Obviously, that needs to be wiped off. Um, the mattress was horrible, like they usually are. But the bedroom set, with all the pieces that it has, even though that looks nasty here, that just needs to be wiped off. Bedroom set, probably, I'd say about 350 350 on that. The TVs, there's two 50-inch TVs. They're newer ones. Um, Probably about a hundred dollars on them, so that's five fifty. 
So even though this unit right here paid six twenty five, should have been more like, you know, three to four hundred dollars would have been, you know, probably about what this should have gone for. And at that at that price, then the bedroom set would have been paying for the whole thing. But that's not what it went for. So after I sell the bedroom set, the two TVs will be almost there. But once you sell all these shoes here, and then all that little stuff adds up, then you know it'll it'll make some money. This thing right here is nice. There's the Minnie Mouse train. You know, quite a few. When you start looking through, there's a lot of new toys. A lot of um, there's a lot of clothes, but a lot of them were nice looking clothes. Um, like a whole bag of brand new socks. All that kind of stuff adds up. Stuff that we didn't even see, that we didn't dig down in there and find. This one did have like the other one. It did have rat droppings, but at least as of yet we're pretty much done but we're not all the way there we haven't seen any rats yet so don't think that they were um in this unit anymore think they got in here because they had bags of bagels in here why would you put bagels and bread in a storage unit it's like even if you came back a couple weeks and got all your stuff out the stuff's not going to be any good it's going to be stale and moldy at that point but people do it but that's it for this unit decent unit not great but decent Way better than the other one we did. The other one was just completely nasty and rat infested. But this one, overall pretty decent. I'd say an average unit. Not good. I mean, sorry, not bad, not great, just an average. But that's how most of them are. You're gonna get a lot of average units. And as long as you're making money, you're good. And then every now and then you're gonna hit, you know, hit a really good one. But you gotta be able to make money on all of these average ones, get your base hits. And then every now and then hit that home run. That's it for this one. If you like this video, give us that thumbs up. That really helps us out a lot. Leave a comment, that helps a lot also. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Y'all have a good one. I should have filmed what just happened. This toboggan right here, see that top? It was in this drawer right here. I opened that thing up and threw it out there and, and Ann just about had a heart attack. Well, maybe it's a good thing I didn't film it because if she would have had a heart attack, then there would have been evidence that it was my fault. But. Yeah, I would have had to edit. I would have had to just destroy this camera, destroy all the footage. But anyways. Thanks. She's sweeping up the rat droppings now. Yeah, and just hoping that a rat doesn't run out. She's deathly afraid of a rat. You gotta watch out, because sometimes they get up on those beams up there, and they run along them. Me and Keith were at a facility one time. They were running everywhere up there. Literally, you'd look at them, and they'd just go running across. And the crazy thing about that, if you haven't seen that video, the facility that we were at where there were rats running all on those beams up there was in the basement of a grocery store and the grocery store was open for business and it's a pretty well-known grocery store grocery store you know you go in there and there's people everywhere and food and in the basement rats running all on the beams everywhere the, was, store? the storage store unit was was in the basement they had a, built a storage facility you went in from the back the whole basement of the building where there was a grocery store and a strip mall above was storage units but it was up in Rome, Rome, Georgia, and there were rats everywhere. <laughs> all right, the shoes in this unit actually turned out to be pretty good. Um, once we priced them all out, put them on the shelf here, it was right around $600. We've already sold a few of the shoes, but um, as you can see here, but sold a few of those. And then also the bedroom set, we've got it set up over here. pretty nice the nightstand i just had to get rid of it was really bad and it had like ashes on the inside where they were smoking smoking pot and all over the top of the <laughs> the nightstand but this thing's pretty nice we got 399 dollars on it and then you know quite a bit of other stuff in that unit so paid 625 you know the shoes you know gets us almost to that point then the bedroom set the tvs and all the other stuff um, unit is looking pretty good, even though I'd have liked to have gotten it for a few hundred dollars less. But, you know, you got to pay up a lot of times if you want something besides trash.